Now in tonight's military matters, it's been a stressful three days for military families in our area. Not sure if the next paycheck would really come on February 1st. But the news, the shutdown is coming to an end. Channel 6 News reporter Jillian Angeline found there's mixed reaction from the community. She joins us now with more. Hi, Jillian. Doug and Leslie, Amanda Sala says it's all she and her friends talked and texted about this weekend, even during the Eagles Vikings game last night at her house. She and other families living paycheck to paycheck already started making changes to their financial plans. Amanda telling me she already delayed their car loan payment because she wanted to afford food for her family, and she says morale was low this morning amongst the soldiers. That's what she heard. But during our interview, the news came down. The Senate reached a decision to end the government shutdown and continue negotiating until February. Amanda says she is now 100% relieved and excited, knowing she can provide for her family, at least for now. Yes, I would be so happy and so relieved and just to know that I can do something for my kids and not have to sit here and worry about, okay, so now what, what happens when this money runs out? Many military families say the Senate's decision is not any better. Some calling it a band-aid on a wounded infection. Others saying it's just kicking the can down the road. Coming up at six, you'll hear more reaction from the local community about this temporary solution. Doug and Leslie, back to you. All right, thanks, Jillian.